Hello, hello. Good evening, everyone. Hello. Hi, everyone. Good evening. How are you? How are you? Hello, I'm okay. Hi, I'm baby. okay. Me escuchan? Can you hear me? Yes. Okay, nice, nice. Uh, so, good evening, everyone. It's super nice to see you today. Eh, terminamos una semana más, so we finished one more week. And uh, it's super nice to, to see you back, that you're nice, that you're good. And we are ready to finish this week in a very positive way. Uh, Vero, hello, Berito. Thank you super early all the time. Madeline, hello. Hi, baby. <laughs> your baby's ready as well. And uh, Milagro, I'm very happy that you're here y que pudo solucionar la situación que tenía. All right. Sí, no sé por qué me está dando problemas. No, no. Nunca había tenido ese problema y ahora siempre que quiero entrar, siempre me... Código. No, es que no me pide eso, sino de que me aparece una pantallita que dice no soy un robot. Ajá, súper raro. Entonces, pero, pero no sé, no sé, le voy a preguntar a mi hijo qué es lo que está pasando ahorita porque no está. No se preocupe, fíjese que ahorita de hecho Zoom está teniendo como un par de eh, updates, están haciendo actualizaciones, entonces nos está dando como problemitas de, de esta índole. Así que siempre es como, bueno, cerrar... Eh, O si lo tiene como en favoritos a veces, puede quitarlo de favoritos quizás y entrar manualmente. Quizás por eso le esté dando esa dificultad. Okay. Pero igual, si, si le vuelve a pasar, eh, le us no para que los compañeros le ayuden, right? Pero eh, I'm very happy that eh, you were able to come in. Ada, good evening. Hello. Nice to see you as well. Eh, Silvia, hello. Good evening. 
¿Cómo están? ¿Cómo estuvo su viernes? Ready, ready to rest? Ready to sleep? Well, I really hope you are ready for today's uh, class. Oh, let me see. Oh, yeah. Okay. So I see they already solved the problem. Okay. So I'm like super happy. Que más entró? Doris. Hello, Doris. Good evening. Thank you very much for coming. Hi, teacher. Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you. And you? Okay. I'm really nice to hear that. I'm okay. I'm okay. You know, today's Friday. I really like Fridays. I don't know why, <laughs> but it's my favorite day of the week. Fridays, yeah, Fridays, I think. So, um, and uh, today we are having class number nine, okay, and we are on October the second. So, ya casi vamos como el corazoncito, vamos a mitad de módulo. Así que, guys, eh, no perdamos el impulso que ya tenemos. Gracias eh, a todas, solamente girls, super punctual, you know. Solamente veo a chicas conectadas right now. So thank you so much for, for the time that you are sharing with us. Um, oh, let me see, veo que alguien más is with us. Jennifer, hello Jennifer, good evening. Thank you so much for hello. joining as well. Uh, so guys, part of the uh, things that we are going to be working today with is Si se recuerdan, yesterday trabajamos un poquito con need to, con have to. Ahora vamos a seguir la parte de need to, have to. Eh, también vamos a practicar un poquito preguntas. We didn't practice it yesterday. We will continue with this. Okay. And, uh, and also, les quiero pedir su colaboración con el, el midterm, all right, que tienen eh, programado. So, normalmente lo tenemos como en mediados, eh, pero sí les quiero pedir su ayuda para completarlo entre ahora y mañana hasta las 10 de la mañana, please. Y así ya quedamos listo con todas las evaluaciones, you know, and um, ready for week number three. So, first, let's take a look at this conversation we have. Eh, and to get started. Vamos a practicar solo algunas palabras que pueden ser kind of new, okay? So please everybody repeat after me, something. Sometime. 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 Okay, uh, one more time, something. Something. Okay, next one, clients. Clients. Next one, reschedule. Schedule. Schedule. Re schedule. Re schedule. Re schedule. Re schedule. Re schedule. Okay. Next one is customers. 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 And the last, interesting. Interesting. Excellent. Yes. Okay. So I would like to have some volunteers to practice the conversation so everybody can listen to. Uh, thank you, Elizabeth, very much. You are going to be my first victim of the night. So you can help me with John. And Doris, can you please help me with the part of Anne? Thank you. Okay. Okay. So, Elizabeth, you can start reading the part of John. Oh. Doris, are you ready? Did you find the page? Did you find the, the material? Yes, 26, 26 oh. thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Bueno. <laughs> Vaya, sería. And is there something you need to do tomorrow? Tomorrow? Yes, actually, I need to call some clients. And you? Well, I have to schedule two meeting for tomorrow. They were canceled today. 
Oh, that's too bad. Yes, I have I have to provide important information to some customers. That sounds interesting. Thank you very much. So these activities are for tomorrow, uh, Saturday, okay? Thank you. Elizabeth, select one more person. Doris, select one more person, please. Herson. Mm, <laughs> Thank you. Is Herson here? Uh, I'm not sure. Herson, are you here? I think he's not here yet. Select another person. Madeline. <laughs> okay, thank you. And Elizabeth? Uh, um, uh, Sandra, Patricia. Sandra, are you here, Sandra? Yes. Oh, yes, there you are. Okay, nice, thank you. So, Sandra, you can start reading the part of John, and Madeline, you can read the part of Anne. Okay. Anne? Is there something you need to do tomorrow? Yes, actually, I need to call the some clients and you. Well, I have to reschedule, reschedule, reschedule to meet him for tomorrow. They were canceled today. Oh, that's too bad. Yes, have to provide. Provide, provide, yes. Provide important information to some customers. That sounds interesting. Okay, very good. Thank you, guys. Now, this little conversation is about things we got to do tomorrow, okay? Tomorrow is Friday, and I don't have to work, okay? <laughs> So tomorrow it's my day off. I don't have to work. So I need to sleep a lot, okay? And I need to go out of my house. <laughs> okay, what do you need to do tomorrow? Okay, what do you have to do tomorrow? The person says here, I need to call some clients. In my case, I don't need to call anybody, okay? I have to reschedule to meetings. Do you have to reschedule anything for tomorrow? Reschedule. Okay, what is the meaning of reschedule? Schedule, if you remember, a schedule is uh, the time, okay? Talking about activities and time. Reschedule is reprogramar, reagendar, all right? Mover fechas. So I have to reschedule to meetings for tomorrow. For example, uh, today, I had to go to my dentist, but I did not have time. So I will reschedule for tomorrow, okay? So reschedule, voy a reprogramar, all right? Uh, they were canceled today, this was the reason. And then the person says, I have to provide important information to some customers about tomorrow, talking about tomorrow. I have to provide important information to some customers. Guys, what about you? What do you need to do tomorrow? Tomorrow is Saturday. Try to, to talk about real situations. What do you have to do tomorrow? And what do you need to do tomorrow? So in my case, I'm not going to work. So I need to organize everything. I need to uh, clean, I need to wash, okay? I have to complete some papers also and some reports, yeah? So. I will give you like five minutes. Make a list on your notebook of the things that you have to do, that you need to do, and you have to do, but for tomorrow, okay? What do you need to do? What do you have to do tomorrow? Five minutes. Write them on your notebook, please. Hello. Teacher, y provide es programar o, o qué eh, es No, ah. Miss, provide, eh, give me a second. It says here, I have to provide important information. So provide is a synonym of give. I have to give important information to some customers, okay? 
I have to provide. I have to give. Provide is give. Okay. Pro reprogramar is reschedule. This word. Reschedule. reschedule. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Teacher. Hola. Yes, Milagro, hello. No sé que, cuál es la instrucción. Como la dio en inglés, no entendí. Oh, don't worry, Milagro. Eh, we have to... Give me a second. Okay, so we have to write eh, things. For example, if you see here, the person says, is there something you need to do tomorrow? Okay, so we are going to write the activities that you have to and need to do tomorrow. Real activities. Tomorrow is Saturday. Pero algunos trabajan. So you can say, I have to work tomorrow. In my case, I'm not working. So uh, I can say, I don't have to work Tomorrow, no es necesario, no lo voy a hacer, ok? So, I have to, I don't have to, I need to, I don't need to. If you remember, Milagro, eh, yesterday trabajamos con need to and have to. Entonces, vamos a hacer una lista de todo lo que usted tiene que hacer para mañana. The things that you have to do tomorrow and need to do tomorrow. Thank you. You are welcome.
Uh, guys, in the meantime, eh, let me go over the attendance. Déjenme pasar asistencia to check who is here. Solo me ayudan with the camera, please. Hold on, hold on. Okay, solamente me ayudan diciéndome present, please, y me ayudan con su cámara. So, I have a Fatima. Present teacher. Thank you, Fatima. Guillermo. Present. Thank you, Guillermo. Nice to have you today. Uh, uh, Ava, hello, Ava. Ada, are you around? Present. Oh, yes, yes, there you are. Thank you. Uh, I got, let me see, Christian. Present. Thank you, Christian. I have, uh, uh, let me see, Elizabeth. Present teacher. Thank you, Elizabeth. Uh, Sandra Patricia. Present. Thank you, Sandra. And um, give me just one second. Silvia Girón. Present. Thank you, Silvia. Francisco Eduardo. Todavía no, he's not here. Eh, Sandra Beatriz. Sandrita, ya vino. Sandra, no yet. Okay. Eh, Herson, Herson, are you here? No, verdad, todavía no. It's not in here. Eh, Madeline. Present. Thank you. Verónica Yesenia. Present. Thank you, Verónica. Eh, Doris. Present teacher. Thank you, Doris. Mila, Maria Milagros. Present teacher. Thank you. Eh, Jennifer Elizabeth. Present teacher. Thank you. Andres Alberto. Tenemos a Andres por acá. Not yet. Okay. And uh, Cesar Humberto. Thank you. Okay, thank you very much. Give me just one second. Hold on, hold on. Okay, guys, uh, so gracias a todos por estar acá, gracias por la asistencia, that's super important, y especialmente por conectarnos eh, tempranito, that's like super, super eh, nice to have you guys, and, um, and, and, and let's take a look at some of your examples, right? So, teacher, I, I hear, sorry. Oh, Herson, hi, good evening, good evening. Good evening. Sorry, teacher. No worries, no worries, Harrison. De hecho, acabo de pasar la asistencia, así que ahorita lo marco. <laughs> Give me a second. How are on you, Harrison? Thank you. Yeah, you're on time. Uh, how are you? Everything good? Yes. All right. The traffic is very 
Terrible. Terrible. Yes, I know. It's Friday. Everybody gets crazy. Hubo payday. Entonces, everybody rain. is like, yes, the rain also. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Oops. Thank you so much. Okay. Oh, oh, sorry. I share something I shouldn't. Okay, everybody. So let's take a look at this one. Uh, we have here, uh, we were talking about the activities that we need to do tomorrow, that we have to do tomorrow. So tell me, ¿qué deben de hacer mañana? What do you have to do tomorrow? Or what is something que no van a hacer mañana because it's your day off? Any volunteer? Thank you, Milagro. You are always my volunteer. <laughs> ¿Qué pasó? ¿Yo qué? Are, are you ready with your examples? ¿Ya tienes tus ejemplos? Ada, thank you. No yes. Te oh, ok, ok. Milagro, go for it. Nice, nice. Ah, tengo, I have to cook tomorrow. Uh -huh. Y en negativo, I don't have to cook tomorrow. Uh -huh. I have to clean my house tomorrow. I don't have to clean my house my house tomorrow okay i have i have to fix my garden tomorrow mm -hmm. i don't have to fix my garden tomorrow ah, i okay. need i need to wash my car tomorrow i don't need to wash my car tomorrow okay. i need to wash the dog tomorrow i don't need to wash the dog tomorrow y la última i need I need to go to the market tomorrow. I don't need to go to the market tomorrow. Ay, very nice exercise, Milagro. That was a good exercise porque las tiene positivas y negativas at the same time. Very good. Now tell me, de las que escribió, ¿cuáles son las que aplican para el día de mañana? Which of them apply for tomorrow? Uh, I have to cook tomorrow. Uh -huh. um, Arepa panes con gallina. <laughs> oh, it's so delicious. Okay. Ya, está, ya tengo lista ahí. Nice. Y también, I have to clean my house tomorrow. Okay, okay. Y de, I need to, uh, I need to wash my car tomorrow. Ah, okay, okay, excellent job. That was nice, that was nice. Thank you. Ava, I saw your hand up. So tell us, Ava. Me escucho. Tiene desactivado el micrófono. Thank you. Sorry. Oh, there you I are. have to go to the clinic. I have to go to, I have to meet in a, one hour in the morning, I don't have to do, go to the hospital, I don't have to go to the check the patient. I I need you to eat the drink coffee at five o'clock. <laughs> I need to early at work, I need to uh, in the supermarket. I need to the prepare in the document and expedient clinics only. Ah, okay. So tomorrow you need to check like documents, but you don't yes. need to check the patient. Yes. Ah, okay. So is it I, better? Do you like it? Do you like it better? Do you prefer that? Um, do you prefer patients or documents? No passion. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. It's and easier. It's is uh, uh, aburrido. Boring. Boring. Ah, oh, okay. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, so tomorrow will be a boring day. But you work yeah. only in the morning or in the afternoon as well. In the morning. Only, only in the morning. Okay. But that that's only like three, four hours, and you are finished. Okay. Um, Four and five hours. Four or five hours. Wow, that's a still a lot. Thank you. Thank you, Ada. Very nice. Thank okay. You. Thank Fatima, you. I want to listen to you, Fatima. What do you need to do tomorrow? Uh, 
Fatima. Yes, there you are. I have to go to work in the morning. I need to write a report. I need to call a customer. I have to eat a noon with my friends. Okay, okay, thank you very much. So you have to work tomorrow. Got that. Uh, I got that part. Thank you. Guillermo, what about you? What are some of the things that you need to do tomorrow? I find things. I have to work tomorrow. I need to go to barber shop tomorrow. I need to check my production report tomorrow. I have to send emails tomorrow. I have to check production processing tomorrow. I need to buy tools coming day. Okay, I heard that you need to go to the barber shop. Is that correct? Yeah, I have to. Oh, you have to, okay. So do you need to get a haircut? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I need, yeah. Okay, thank you, thank you very much. I got Christian, Christian, what do you need to do tomorrow? Hola, hola, hola. I need to eat tomorrow with my friend at noon. I need to get up early tomorrow. I need to go work because I have a meeting. I need to bath myself tomorrow. Only that. Okay, can you repeat the last activity you mentioned, please? I need to bath my pet tomorrow. Ah, okay, okay, got it. Thank you. I heard I need to like bait myself. Ah, okay. <laughs> okay, thank you. That was good. That was good. Okay, everybody. Nice job. That was very good. So we are talking about the need to, what you need to do, what you have to do. Now let's take a look at the following chart that is in your material. It says here, write about something you have to or need to do these days. But vamos a agregar like the activity, right? And also including all of this. For example, when, all right? When do you need to work? When do you need to supervise? When do you need to go to your office? What time? What time do you need to get up early? What time do you need to study, for example? No vamos a escribir las preguntas ahorita, sino que vamos a escribir como una oración donde incluyamos ese, eh, la respuesta de, de esta WH. Acá nos pregunta when. Nos pregunta what time y luego tenemos where. Por ejemplo, I need to, I need to go to the doctor very soon. <laughs> Because no voy a un doctor en años. So I need to go to the doctor soon. Okay. Eh, what time? Puedo incluir la hora como lo dijo Kristen. I need to get up early. Puede ser incluso más específico. Tomorrow I need to get up at 5 a.m. Porque tengo... Because I have a meeting, because I have is something important to do. Where? ¿A dónde van a ir? I need to go to the supermarket because I don't have food, because I don't have water. Or I need to go to Claro because I need to pay for a service. So vamos a incluir un par de oraciones, ok, eh, agregando esos detalles. When, what time, where. Con dos por cada una sería suficiente. To each, that would be super good. I will give you some minutes and please eh, denme confirmación verbal cuando termine. Give me verbal confirmation. Una consulta, teacher. No me queda algo muy claro. Dígame. Hello. Hello, hello. Oh. Yeah, hello. I'm sorry, no le pude escuchar no. anteriormente. Creo que se me cortó un poquito. Dígame. Eh, solamente le escuché que no le quedaba una parte clara, but no escuché cuál, eh, what part exactly. Sí. 
si vamos a escribir, digamos, debajo de when, eh, solo escribir el, el, el día, por ejemplo, o escribir la oración completa en cada, en cada uno de los cuadros. Sí, vamos a escribir dos ejemplos eh, respondiendo es Imagínense que hay una pregunta, ¿cuándo va a ser esto? Right? Usted va a escribir la oración I need to, incluyendo la respuesta para ese when. Remember that when oh. es mucho más general que el what time. Puede ser on Monday, on Tuesday, puede ser next week, puede ser soon, in one year. Uh, I need to buy a house, oh. for example. Entonces, acá abajo me va a escribir la oración completa, incluyéndome la respuesta de esta WH word. Pero no tiene sé. que ir relacionada. Por ejemplo, el, el when tiene que ir relacionada con uh, what time y el word. O sea, la, la oración tiene que ir oh, relacionada entre usted, las tres. Usted ser, ajá. No, 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 no se preocupe. Pueden ser independientes. Una oración para when, otra ah. incluyendo la respuesta para what time, ya le comprendí. Y otra respuesta para where. No es necesario que una sola respondiendo los tres elementos, right? Esa es creo su pregunta. No. Oh. All right. Yes. No, it's not necessary. It's not necessary. Yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Welcome. Are you ready? Do you need more time? One minute, two minutes. Okay, okay. Thank you, Ada. Thank you, Doris. Done. Okay, thank you, guys. Okay, very good. Now, listen up. We are going to make some groups. 
because I really need to, to, I want you to talk to other people, to listen to them, practice listening, and tell them the activities that you need to do for tomorrow. So, incluyamos estas respuestas para when, para what time, para where, right? So, let me make some groups and uh, everybody, let's join, join there. Say hello to them and let's practice. Sandra. So, everybody, let's, let's go. Hello, teacher. Mis compañeras no habían terminado, no estaban practicando nada. Deme un segundito. 
Bemis, no se preocupe, la voy a enviar a otro grupo. ¿Qué me hace con...? Uh, ok, I'm going to send you to this group. Thank you, teacher. You are welcome. Mm, ok, let, let's give it a try. No sé si le mandó el mismo, I hope not. <laughs> ok, no, you can go to, a, to this group now. Now, o sea, ahora. Ajá. Because. ¿Cómo se escribe now? N-O-W. N-O. Ah, ya, yeah, ajá, now. Because go to beach tomorrow. Because. Because, ¿qué sigue? Go to beach tomorrow. Go to beach. Tomorrow. Ajá. Uh -huh. Yo no necesito comer marisco uh, ahora, ahora, ahora ¿Por qué? porque eh, iré a la playa mañana. Correcto. ¿Qué más puso? Solo dos eran por, por cada una, entendí yo. Ajá, yo sí. Dos, ¿Y sí. las otras? ¿Las del tiempo? Okay. La de tiempo es, I, I need to clean house at 8 a.m. Repeat, I need to clean house, house. at 8 at. a.m. Eh, me quedé después de house at 8 a.m. Hora 8. Ah, a 8 a.m. A.m. Entonces yo no le entendí a la, a la, a la Miss que. Bueno, sí, siga. Después me. Ok. I need to go to the party at 8 p.m. I need to the party? Go to the party at 8 p.m. Siempre a las 8 p.m. Ajá, a las 8. Es que la de arriba era a las 3, pero ya no veo ya ahorita los ojos. Entonces digo, I need, a ver si le copié bien. I need to the party at 8 p.m. Ah. And that's it. Las mías serían, este, what can I go to the hospital? When you have the appointment with the doctor. Um, what time will you get home? Pero eso no le contestaba porque no sabía cómo contestarla, pero... La otra, la otra que dice es, what time are you gonna meet up with Alejandra? We will meet at 17 p.m. Y el último, ah, Miss, eh, teacher. Teacher. Hello, Hello girls. Yes, tell me. Uh -huh. eh, cuando yo quiero decir, ¿dónde está mi teléfono? Es, where it, where it is, no, where is it my phone, o where is my phone? Where is my phone? Where is my phone? Yeah, where is my phone? Eh, solamente, Verónica, que eh, las preguntas que llevamos a agregar, bueno, well, no preguntas, right? Sino los detalles que llevamos a agregar son relacionados con cosas que necesitan hacer. So, things that you need to do. 
Eh, por ejemplo, si dice where, es como, por ejemplo, if I tell you, necesito salir, I need to go out. Pero puedo ser bien específica y menciono where. I need to go to, entonces le agregamos ya el where como respuesta. Eh, so I need to go to the hospital, I need to go to the zoo, I need to go to the bank. Entonces lo que tenemos ahí solo son indicadores. Yes. If you pay attention, eh, dice, ahorita le muestro, dice write about something you have to or need to do these days. Y agregando como la respuesta de estas preguntas, de when, de what time y de where. So vamos a escribir como no la pregunta, sino la respuesta, agregando esos detalles. Si usted dice when, por ejemplo, eh, no hemos visto todavía preguntas, entonces por eso. Si usted dice when, es como yo necesito hacer algo, pero ¿cuándo? Ok, when. So I need to, in my case, for example, I need to visit uh, my mother, okay, tomorrow. Entonces, ese tomorrow sería el when, okay. Or I need to complete a report uh, on Monday. Ese on Monday uh, ya es el when. Are you following me? So, no, no son como las preguntas, right? Sí. Sino las respuestas. Ajá, ah, sí, okay. las respuestas. Va. Yes, yes, exactly, exactly. So, give it a try, give it a try. Intentemos. And si le quedaron más dudas, chicos, eh, ask me, okay? No, no, no worries. So, don't hesitate. No duden en, en, en preguntar, please. Don't, ask, don't hesitate to ask. Estamos acá para ayudar eso, right? We are here to help you guys. So I'll give you some more minutes. Uh, try to continue. Uh, I have to take my daughter to the doctor at nine o'clock. Okay. Y I need to go. No, verdad? No, así no pasa todo. Hi. Milagro, le quiere hacer una pregunta. Hey girls, tell me. No, explícale usted, Sandrita, por favor. Ah, vaya. Right. Lo que sucede es que when, what time, y where. Pensó que esas palabras en sí íbamos a utilizar. Ah, ok. Entonces yo le explicaba que el when era, se refería a, a momentos, a tiempos. Hacer oraciones. Que Ajá, yo. el what time era a qué hora, una hora en específico. Correcto. Y el where, el lugar donde iba a hacer la acción. Exactly. Uh, yeah, if you take a look here, dice write about something. Eh, yo sé que está la parte de when y quizás eso es como lo que puede ser confuso, no se preocupen. I mean, acabo de revisar y los demás también tenían como like, la duda por ahí. Eh, porque aparece when y aparece what time, pero no vamos a agregar eso dentro de nuestras oraciones, sino que vamos a escribir write about something you have to or you need to do these days, um, escribiendo o agregando el detalle de la, de la respuesta, right? Si, por ejemplo, yo le digo, I need, to, um, I need to finish my report. Pero usted me pregunta, when? Entonces, puede agregar la respuesta de ese when. I need to finish my mm -hmm. report tomorrow. Ese tomorrow, ya estoy respondiendo when, ¿ok? Or, I need to go to the bank. Sí, o sea, que Sandra lo ha hecho, lo ha hecho bien. Eh, estuve escuchando las de Sandra, creería. I think I was listening to Sandra before. And they were quite good. Solamente si, si ustedes le agregaron la parte de when, de what time, hagamos el cambio eh, y escribamos una, una oración a, a, escribiendo la respuesta, right? Try to include the answer. Como lo, lo hacíamos ayer, if you remember, agregábamos I need to do this, I have to do this, solo que ahora vamos a escribir también el detalle de, de cómo les explico, dar de, más de, detalles. De, de. De lugar, Exacto. de tiempo, uh -huh. y when, ¿qué sería? Es, de hecho, el lo when es el tiempo. When es el, el tiempo. Time es el tiempo específico. Pregunta cuándo. Exacto. Ajá, a la hora. A qué hora es. Ah. En, en otras palabras, lugar? lo que estamos haciendo es dando más detalles. Lo mismo que hicimos ayer, pero ahora con más detalles. All right. Ayer decíamos, por ejemplo... Ok, I need to work. I need to talk to my boss. Ahora vamos a agregar más detalles. I need to talk to my boss tomorrow. Siendo como bien específico. I need to eh, wash my, my clothes at 7 a.m. Entonces vamos agregando más detalles. So, podemos utilizar las mismas de ayer, eh, girls, 
Solo agreguemos esos detalles, right? De tiempo, de hora o no, de lugar. De hora, de lugar. Okay. Uh -huh. Exacto. Pero si yo digo, teacher, I need to go to supermarket because the cook lunch is, está bien. The cook. Ah, súper bien. Pero sí. quizás como because I, I need to go to the supermarket because I, I, I have cook. to cook. Uh -huh, I because have. I have to cook or I need to cook lunch. Uh -huh. Yeah, lo demás está super bien. The rest is good. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah. Thank you. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Bien. Si gusta, modifíquelas, Milagro, en lo que regresamos y las, y las vemos, las escuchamos. Sí, ahorita voy a trabajar en eso. What time do you send a report? I need to send self report at seven o'clock. Oh, well, llamamos la otra. What time do you go to the supermarket? What time to, do you do go, you to, go to the supermarket? Entonces, ahí está la respuesta. I need to go to the supermarket. I need to go to the supermarket. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow. Ah, oh, okay. Tomorrow, huh? What up, what up everyone, so thank you so much for coming back, vamos a esperar unos segunditos mientras regresa el resto. Eh, I think there was a little confusion in this part, y solamente like to clarify this part, no hemos visto todavía eh, las respuestas, no, I, I mean, sorry. No hemos visto todavía las preguntas, ¿verdad? Right? No hemos visto cómo organizar las preguntas. Entonces, lo único que estábamos haciendo era, eh, similar a lo que hicimos ayer, escribir pre eh, oraciones, pero agregándole más detalle, ¿ok? So, for example, if I say, what do you need to do? Oh, I need to eh, work tomorrow, ¿ok? Pero necesito ahora que le agreguemos como detalles, ¿ok? Esos detalles pueden ser, when I need to work tomorrow super early, Ok, o lo puedo agregar what time. I need to work tomorrow at 7 a.m., at 6 a.m., at 5 a.m. O incluimos como a dónde. I need to work tomorrow in my house. Ok, so, no es que le van a agregar when, ni what time, ni where, sino vamos a dar como la respuesta, right? So, eh, talking about this, hello. Entonces, porque esa era la duda que yo tenía, que yes. o sea, todavía las he hecho la oración. Entonces, eh, eh, sería, por ejemplo, sería, I need to be ready mm -hmm. at 17 to go to diner. Ah, that's good. That's very good. Mm -hmm. Porque me está agregando, de hecho, más detalles. So, I need to be ready okay. at 7, ya incluimos el tiempo, because, incluyo, incluso me está escribiendo, me está agregando una razón, because I need to be ready to have, to eat, okay, to go out, to have dinner, okay, yes, that's super good, así es como vamos agregando detalles de cuándo, dónde, incluso le pueden agregar con quién, where, etc. Mm -hmm. Yes, Vero, that was it, very good. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. So now, vamos a unir esta actividad, así que no se preocupen si you got, you got it wrong o le agregaron la parte de what time, porque ahorita vamos a eso. So vamos a unirlas. So no worries. Now, ¿cómo hacemos preguntas? How do we make questions? Vamos siempre agregando como detalles, right? For example, here we have write five questions using need to or have to, cualquiera de las dos. So when do you need to? Or when do you have to? Remember that need to expresa una necesidad and have to es una obligación. Something that uh, you are pushing me to, que yo debo de, de rendir cuentas, let's say, okay, an obligation. So when do you need to? Uh, when do you need to go to work? When do you need to pay your bills? When do you have to pay your bills? 
when do you need to go to the hospital? Okay, so when, eh, what? Um, acá igual le pueden cambiar el need to por el have to and it's fine. What do you need to do tomorrow? What do you need to um, complete? Okay, what do you need to buy? What do you need to sell? What do you need to receive? So podemos agregarle cualquier acción, right? Then we have where. Where do you need to go? Where do you need to, um, where do you need to be tomorrow? Okay. Who? ¿A quién nos referimos con el who, guys? Who? ¿Quién? A una persona. ¿Quién? Exactly. Who do you need to? ¿A quién necesitas hablarle? Who do you need to call? ¿A quién necesit ¿Con quién necesitas reunirte? Who do you need to meet? Okay. ¿A quién necesitas ver? Who do you need to see tomorrow? Or who do you need to talk to? Okay. Uh, ¿O a quién necesitas reportarte? Who do you need to report in your workplace? Okay. ¿A qué horas necesitas tomarte una pastilla? What time do you need to take your pills? Yeah. What time do you need to, um, I don't know, wake up every day? Or what time do you have to wake up every day? So, ese es el inicio. This is the very beginning of your question. Sean creativos, be creative, okay? And intentemos completarlo. Try to complete it. Remember, eh, como nos decía César ayer, eh, hablamos de actividades. Entonces, acá necesito una acción, es decir, un verbo. When do you need to? Necesito un verbo. When do you need to talk? When do you need to eat? So, a verb, okay? I will give you some minutes. Si tienen dudas, let me know. Y si necesita que le revise algún ejemplo, eh, write it in the chat, type it in the chat y lo reviso con gusto. Una de cada una, teacher. Eh, yes, miss. Cabalito con las que están acá. When, what, okay. where, who, what time. Nos faltan algunos acá. Por ejemplo, no está which. Tampoco está how. De cómo. All right. Eh, pero si las quieren agregar, no hay problema. I mean, it's super good, even better, right? Okay, thank you. Welcome.
Uh, if you finish, please give me some verbal confirmation. And if you need What some mean? help. Yeah, okay. Thank you, Francisco, for uh, that's super good. No problem. And if you need some help, please tell me. Let me know. Salon de belleza, teacher. A beauty salon. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. <laughs> Campamento is camp, verdad? Uh, yeah, you can say a camp. Uh huh. Campsite. Okay. What time do you need to visit the beautiful salon? <laughs> Okay. <laughs> well, I need to go every day, but. <laughs> so, what time? Two what? hours. Oh, like Four how much hours. time? <laughs> it, that's that's difficult because normally I get my hair done because I'm curly, so oh. I I straighten my hair. So that's like oh. four hours. <laughs> yeah, like four or five hours. And you, Ada, how, how much time do you need to, to be at the beauty salon? Uh, two hours in the week. Only oh, oh, but in the week. <laughs> okay. Ah, you get a treatment. I imagine. So what do you get doing? So <laughs> ¿qué, qué le what do you get doing? Nails? No, eh, pistoleado. Ah, okay, okay. You get, you get your hair done. Uh -huh. <laughs> nice. No, but yes, you're right, you're right. No se puede cause, cause, you know, with the alcohol, so it's like, uh, it's done, wow, it's over. <laughs> How do you call the other liquid? Alcohol wow. and cuaternario, something, right? <laughs> yes. Quaternario, right? Mm -hmm. So it's not possible. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Hey, Andres. Good evening. Hi. Thank you for joining. Hi, everybody. Hi. How are you? How was the traffic, Andres? Horrible. Oh, horrible. Horrible, horrible. ¿Cuánto tiempo se estuvo? How long were you in traffic? One hour, two hours. Uh, uh, one, hour, one hour and middle. Wow, that's a lot. And normally, uh, and normally uh, how long do you take? Uh, normally that uh, part time. No, or 15 oh, minutes. 15 minutes. Oh, media hora. And ¿Sí? today, one hour oh. and a half. Wow. Yeah, so it's... That, that uh, in going to the uh, center of San Salvador. Downtown San Salvador. Mm -hmm. Downtown in San Salvador and they visit a, a provider mm -hmm. that desde de ahí hasta Antiguo Cujeplan <laughs> fue ah, algo largo. Ah, okay, okay. Yes, and, and the problem is uh, the, the traffic in downtown San Salvador. Aparte que bien desordenado, yeah. right? And that's more difficult. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, but thank you. Thank you yeah. so much for being here. Um, guys, how are you doing there? Elizabeth, uh, how are you here? Are you almost done? Cesar, do you need more time? No, teacher, I don't. Okay, you're done. Thank you. Done, ready. Nice. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, Jennifer, do you need more time? Are we ready? Do you have your questions? Do you have any question or, yes. alguna, or any doubt? 
Madeline. Cuando yo quiero decir quién necesitas que te ayude. ¿Quién necesitas que te ayude? <risa> ok. Es que, es que, vaya, o para formular una pregunta con who. Okay. Who do you need to? Eso está difícil, así que let me share my screen. <risa> Porque va un poco más elaborada. Uh, ok. So here. Go who? Teacher. Yes. Teacher. Sería, who do you need to... Help you. To help or to help you mm -hmm. to talk. Who do you need to talk okay. to? La primera es como las más normales, right? Who do you need to? A quién necesi con quién necesitas tú hablar? But your question is, ¿quién necesitas que te ayude? So who do you need to help you? Suena rarito, okay? So who do, porque tenemos doble you. Who do you need to help you? Or, algo más sencillo sería, who do you need help from? Who do you need help from? ¿De quién necesitas ayuda? So that would be like another possibility para no repetir el you. Who do you need help from? Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Creo que Elizabeth tenía una pregunta. ¿Elizabeth? Sí, teacher. Este, yo hice de, de tiempo. No sé si está bien la pregunta que, que puse. Eh, como ¿Cuánto tiempo necesitas para recuperarte? Mm, bye, ya sea de salud. No. Mm, permítame un segundito. Eh, ¿Cuánto tiempo necesitas para recuperarte de salud? ¿Cómo la tiene Elizabeth? ¿Qué do you have? Yo le puse, what time do you need to recover? Okay, what time do you need to recover? Oh, what time? Uh, solamente que hay una cosita con el uso de what time. What time normalmente es como bien lineal y me pide solo una hora, right? Hora. What time es la hora. Mm -hmm. So, eh, what time do you need to recover? Lo de, yo lo comprendo de forma diferente. Si necesito un periodo de tiempo, si se recuerdan, había una expresión para preguntar cuánto tiempo. So, vamos a hacer el cambio de what time hacia esa expresión que sería, how much, como es tiempo, how much time do you need to recover? Entonces, cambiamos totalmente el what time a how much time. Okay. Y esa pregunta también la podemos agregar, ¿no? Sí, por supuesto, of course, you can do it. Incluso acá usted puede ser más específica porque how much time is bien general. So you need, for example, eh, how many days, yeah? How many days do you need to recover? How días? many months? Yeah, you can be more specific, of course. Pero como es un periodo, ya no es una hora, si necesito hacer el cambio eh, de what time hasta, hasta how much or how many es el periodo, es el cuánto. Ah, uh -huh. Ok, gracias, teacher. You're welcome, yes. Si yo digo, what time do you need to go to house? Uh -huh. Aplica para el what time. Yes, what time do you need to go to yeah. your house? Como por ejemplo, cuando usted pide permiso, and you say, hey boss, I need to go to my cuando house. Los hijos. Oh, uh -huh. ok, Porque y él le pregunta. está preguntando a su hijo. <laughs> Y le pregunta y le a qué horas. A qué hora va a regresar a casa. Ah, ah ok. Uh, what time do you need to go to house? What time Cuando do you me need refiero to... a eso. You... Solamente, solamente que se... Yeah, solo que si usted le pide permiso, sería como I. What time do I need to return? Porque no, digamos no, no, que no. es su hijo. Que or... Yo le estoy preguntando a mi hijo. Yo mm -hmm. le estoy preguntando a mi hijo. What time do you need to come back? Sería en español como hasta qué horas necesita. A qué, ajá, a qué horas, eh, cuánto qué tiempo hora necesitas para, para regresar a casa. Como sería un periodo, sería ya no solamente una hora específica, sino que su pregunta va referida a un periodo de tiempo, es similar a la pregunta de Elizabeth. Sería entonces, how much ajá, time, how much pregunta, time do you need? Much. Uh -huh. Sí, sería how much time okay. do you need. Por ejemplo, ¿cuánto tiempo necesitas para hacer la tarea, right? How much time do you need to complete your homework? Uh -huh. So, or how much time do okay. you need 
Ya, yeah, sería Hamacho, porque es un feriado. Uh -huh. Uh, okay, you're welcome. Teacher, uh, I have a question. I need to check my question. Yes, tell me. Uh, correct. Uh, where do you need to repair your car? It's okay? Yeah, that's good. Where do you need to repair your car? Where no. and when? Yeah, they are good. I mean, yes, yes, they are good. No, yes. where, donde, qué lugar? Where, donde, and when, you said. Like, cuando. Uh -huh. Where, una similar a esta. What do you have? Where do you need to repair your car? Donde tú necesitas reparar? ¿A dónde necesitarías? Yeah, where do you need no, to repair your car? ¿Dónde tú repararías el carro? No sé. Eh, Lo que sucede es que need es la necesidad. Tell me, Cesar. Ya vemos la de Harrison. No, perdón. No, perdón. No, no, no se preocupe. Probablemente es la, eh, similar el contexto. Sí, porque yo, yo la puse, where do you need to fix your car? Ok. Yeah, that's ok. I mean, sí. está, está bien, right? El, yo entiendo que la pregunta va relacionada a qué lugar usted va y necesita ir a ese lugar para reparar el carro, right? That is the idea. So, si esa es la idea, yeah, you're good. <laughs> yeah. Uh, está bien implementado okay. los verbos. It's correct. The, the, the question. question. Yes, yes, that's good. That's good. Pero... Pero Gerson, creo que le escuché un detalle más. Es que a veces uno se confunde con el... Dígame. Tell me. No, lo que sucede no, 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 es que no, no, no. le escuché esa Solamente parte que de... A veces uno tal vez se confunde, se, se confunde uno tal vez por el nivel de, de la necesidad. O sea, pero es tácito, no sé. I mean, la pregunta es, es yeah, usted está preguntando dónde necesita ir para reparar el carro, right? That, that's what I understand. Pero es diferente si usted le pregunta, ¿a dónde repararías? Porque ya no hablamos de una necesidad y eso lo vamos a ver luego. Ese es, ¿no? ese, 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 ese es lo que quiero yo, eso es lo que yo quiero decir. ¿Está sí. bien así? Mm, sí, solamente. ¿Dónde, no, ¿dónde repararías? Ajá, no, no, Harrison, because in that case ya no hablamos de una necesidad o no, de una obligación, sino que hablamos de como que usted tiene la opción y a dónde le gustaría ir. Entonces usamos would, pero lo vamos a ver luego. We are going to check that later. That's good. Porque need es una necesidad, right? Like when you say, I need to repair my car. Realmente necesita hacerlo. Ok, so where do you need to repair your car? Hablamos que, por ejemplo, la aseguradora lo obliga a ir a un lugar y necesita repararlo, right? So everybody... Ah, eh, ¿En ese caso sería cómo? La pregunta. I mean, su pregunta está bien, pero en el sentido de necesidad. Ah, ok. Mm -hmm. Your question is good. Oh, yes, okay. yes, your question is good. Ok, everybody, so we need to practice this topic. We gotta really practice this. So, ya tenemos las preguntas, I guess, everybody. So, let's go ahead and practice. We are going to make some groups, the group of different, claro. We are going to create different groups. Interview your classmate, ask questions to your classmate, okay? And uh, then we come back and we are going to go over our speaking. Give me a second. Okay, there we go. So, please, everybody, let's go to these uh, groups. Solo let me confirm que todos me vayan a grupos diferentes. Okay, now we're good. Okay, everybody, so let's go to the groups and inter uh, interview your classmate. Ask the questions to your classmate. If you have questions, recuerden que hay una opción que dice pedir ayuda, so you can call me. So everybody, let's go to the groups. <coughs> Teacher, le quiero hacer una pregunta. Dígame, Milagro. Eh, esta pregunta estaría bien. What, what do you need to be happy? 
what do you what do you need to be happy that's that's a good question yes see very complicated but yes <laughs> what do you need to be happy yeah that's a good question estaría bien eso yes yes of course este tema sí que me ha trabado toda créame eso veo, pero yo creo que, que es como lo que usted siente, fíjese, porque me estuvo diciendo los ejercicios, los ejemplos y estaban súper bien. Your examples are good. So, no, no lo complique too much. No, no, okay. se, no se preocupe too much. Ok, thank you. You're welcome. Time will she arrive? Oh, pero, pero no vamos a ocupar el, 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 el need to ni o el have to. What, but what do you need to in the house? Hi guys, good evening. Uh, Hi, teacher. Okay, so the idea, right, is to, no, you're good, <laughs> you're good, pero solo creo que me le falta el verbo, fíjese. Because um, creo que me utilizó esto, what time do you need to in the house? Pero me le falta que la acción, como a qué horas tú necesitas, pero como el qué, right? Me le falta un verbo ahí, antes de donde dice in your house. Mm -hmm. Como a qué horas usted necesita, por ejemplo, no sé, limpiar. What time do you need to clean your house? A qué horas necesita cocinar. What time do you need to cook your, in your house? Me le falta uh, una acción ahí. Uh -huh. Eso le puedo poner ¿Cómo? cualquier... Yes. Me preguntan mucho más en lo que yo lo arreglo. ¿Cómo? Eh, oraciones de los compañeros mientras yo arreglo las mías. Ya no se preocupe, okay. o solo agreguele el verbo, solo agreguele cualquier verbo que se le venga a la mente. What, that, what do you need to cook? Oh, ok, that's ok. What do you In need to house? cook? Ok, o por ejemplo, para ser como más específico, what do you need to cook? I don't know, a cake. What do you need to cook a dinner, for example? Uh -huh. So you can be very specific. Pero eso está súper bien. Solamente es el verbo el que, el que is missing. <laughs> But you got it, you got it. Eh, yo tengo, when do you have to start to work? Doris. When do you have? When do you have to start to work? What do you need to cook? I have to start to. I need to go. Era mi misma duda que tenía cuando se la preguntó. Ah, sorry. I need to go to the camp. Repeat. Repeat where, the question, Sandra. Where do you need to go to camp? Uh, where, where? I need to go to the camp in uh, Los Planes de Renderos. Así, ¿verdad? ¿Dónde? No. Mm -hmm. Sí, ¿dónde? 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 Sí. Okay. I need I, to go I need, to camp. I need to go camp a Montecristo. Oh, ah. Trifinio. I need, I need to go to the hospital. Yeah, good, me good. too. It's well, raining too much. <laughs> Sigo con la otra. Do you, do you need a, a good car? A un, uh, four, uh, ¿Cómo es? ¿Cuatro por cuatro? Yes. Four to four. four. to four. Yeah. Four to yeah. four. You need a, a, a like a, that type of car. No, but guys, I can recommend you one place that is called Casa de Cristal. It yes, is I, I, yeah. beautiful. Yes. Yeah. Beautiful. Beautiful place. place. Yeah. yeah. Is that the is the the street on the? ¿Cómo se llama? It's in the middle of the volcanoes. 
Okay. Okay. Yes. Uh, yes. 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 No, Do you know? no vending, that's why. Not right, no. Uh -huh, no. No vending, no. But, no. Yeah. Because you go camping. Oh, yeah, yes. there, is, there is a store. There is a super small store, and you can buy maybe coffee, but, but you can go camping. There are houses that are like little cabins, and you can pay, but it's expensive. So you can take a car, and you can camp. But it's a very good experience. So you can say the, the place is beautiful. I went in December last year. That was very oh. nice. Oh. Very good. It's, no, it's but nice. it, it was not cold. It was not cold, but it was a super oh. good experience. And in the morning, in la madrugada, eh, subimos al volcán. Like at 4 a.m. in the morning, we went to the volcano. That was like super good. Lléveme, lléveme, lléveme. Let's go, go let's go. Let's go, go. go teacher, let's, let's go. go. It's a good place. Yes. Yeah. Sandra, how are you? Sandra, have you been no, there? No, solo he llegado a Cerro Verde nada más. Mm, but... In the Cerro Verde, eh... Está, está más abajo. Está uh -huh. en el hotel. Ah, sí, sí, sí. Hay un hotel. Sí. ¿Es de la hotel? ¿Es de la hotel? ¿Es de la hotel? ¿Es de la hotel? Ah, yes. antes. Yes. Restauración. No. no. Antes funcionó. Restauración. Actuality. Eso. Pero, Actuality no, pero no está funcionando. Restauración de hotel en el Cerro Verde. No, uh, in construction. In uh, wow. Quality in construction. No the restoration of the hotel. No, uh, uh, no. Andres says, Andres says that is in process. Sí. Mm -hmm. No, but but from yeah. from the Cerro Verde, hay una callecita. There is like a tiny street that takes you to Casa de Cristal. And, and at the beginning, it is yeah. necessary, I think, que sea 4x4. Otherwise, ahí lo va a dejar. <laughs> no, but it's, but it's a good yeah. experience. It's a very nice experience. Let's yeah. go. <laughs> I need to walk. I need to do exercise. No, OK, vamos con what time, verdad? Okay. What time? Or oh, when? Or oh, when? Do you think otra de when? When do okay. you have to send the report? How many? Oh, 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 si, oh, si pregunta, okay. what time do you do have, uh, do you do exercise? Sería. Uh, eh, a qué horas tiene que hacer ejercicio. Uh -huh. A qué horas. Ah, entonces yo las hago, I need to do exercise at seven at night. Okay. Okay. Okay, in my tour. Fatima. Okay. Uh, where do you need to fix your car? Uh, where do you need to fix your car? ¿Cómo arreglar? Arreglar yes. su carro, yes. ¿eh? ¿A dónde? Uh, I have to. Uh, I think I have to. Uh, uh, yeah, group of cook. <laughs> I have to. Uh, group of cook. I have to fix. Ah, okay. Okay, <laughs> César. Yes. Sí. Esta es ficticia la pregunta. Where do you have to organize the party? Oh. 
Organize the party. Ajá. Nada más en la realidad es ficticia la pregunta. Ok. I need to... I need... I need to organize the party in in the hotel, hotel in, in the president hotel. Hotel president. Hotel president. Hotel president. Yes. Ada. Okay. Yo creo que sí. Next question. Ah, yo voy. Where do you need to be at the say uh uh okay? In 6 p.m. Isaac acaba de poner una. ¿Para quién, don Isaac? Dice, when do you have to visit the doctor? Ever. <laughs> I don't have this video. When do you have to visit? Isaac the dice cómo sería la cómo sería la pregunta correcta. When do you have to visit the doctor? Él está preguntando si así está bien. Any, anyone. Anyone. Cuando tú, anyone. A cualquiera, dice que nos pregunta. When do you have to visit? To... Está bien, yo creo que está bien la pregunta. When, cuando tú necesitas visitar al doctor. Eso estaba refiriendo a la anterior. Ah, bueno. <risa> <risa> es cierto, ya vi. Bueno. <risa> Okay, I need to visit the doctor <laughs> uh, on Friday. When? On Friday, okay. Pregunte, Silvia. I did this. <laughs> what time you had to wash the clothes. Repeat, please. What time you, you have to wash the clothes? Or oh, is need, no, have to ever. Puede decir have to or need to. Pero a quién le pregunta? Ay, perdón. A don Guillermo. What time do you what have time to? To watch the clothes. Sorry, guys. It is just kind of funny to listen to Don, Don Isaac, Don Guillermo. <laughs> Somos dones, huh? I mean, yeah, yeah, I know, but, but, but in English, it suddenly is like Don. <laughs> it, it, <laughs> y cómo podemos decir Don Guillermo uh, en inglés? We Sir, don't use Sir it. Guillermo. No, we oh, don't thanks. use it. We just say Guillermo. Uh -huh. <laughs> but, but that's why. <laughs> Me pareció divertido that he was like Don Isaac, what? <laughs> Ya entraron en la etapa de dones. Lastimosamente. Ahí está aquí, Israel. Está riendo. Sí. What do you need to speak English well? Oh, that's okay. What do you need to speak English well? Mm -hmm. So, guys, what do you need to speak English well? I need, uh, I need to speak English well when finish the Moles. Mm -hmm. so, Twenty moles. Yeah. Twenty moles. Well, less. Yeah. Okay. Oh. I success <laughs> practice more. Mm -hmm. So, what do you need? What do you need to speak English? Practice more. What do you need to? Speak I need to. I need to finish the the program. The program. Okay. You need to finish the program. You need to practice. What else? To speak English like very well. 
I know the the pair. I need to learn the verbs, the conjugation. Conjugation, verb. Mm -hmm. Vocabulary, we need to learn more vocabulary. Conjugation. Con eh? I conjugación. need to read a es... lot. Conjugation, uh -huh. uh, I success, I need to read a lot. Yes, it's important to read a lot and to listen. It's important to listen to music, listen to videos. Listening is very important. Uh -huh. Sylvia, what do you need? I need to um, more more information for my mind. You need more information mind. for your mind. Mind. Like mine? Yes. Ah, oh, okay. You need more information. Okay, you need more information. Okay, yes, very nice. Okay, guys, I like it. I like the part of the dawn also. <laughs> That's very funny. <laughs> okay, guys, uh, time is over. Let's go back to the other meeting. That's just fine. Thank you guys. Uh, thank you so much for coming back. Esperamos un minutito mientras vienen uh, the rest of your classmates. Like when everyone is coming back. Oh, ya casi son las 10, my goodness. Time is flying today. Okay, 16. I'm missing one person. Okay, everybody, so tell me, um, help me please with the questions. What do you need to? Can you una pregunta con what do you need to? What do you need to? Thank you, Elizabeth. <laughs> este, when do you need to take free time? Oh, okay. When do you need to take free time? That's okay. Thank you. Uh, let me see. Let me choose just another person. Eh, Veronica, ayúdame con otra pregunta. Help me with another question, please. What time do you need to arrive a meeting? What time do you need to arrive to the meeting? Excellent. Yes. Yo and, tengo una. Yes, Milagro, tell me. What do you need to be happy? That's a very good one and a very complicated one. <laughs> so let, let's, <laughs> let's take some minutes to answer that. I think it's a very interesting question. What do you need to be happy? So what is something that you feel you need to be happy? Uh, Fatima, what do you need? Cesar, what do you need to be happy? Guillermo, what do you need to be happy? On Monday. More money. <laughs> okay, more money. That's okay. Sandra, what do you need to be happy? Christian, what do you need? Vacation. Okay, vacation, money. Okay, anybody else? Andres, what do you need to be happy? Coffee. Coffee, okay. That's and right. pupusas. <laughs> Coffee and pupusas. Okay. Um, the full package. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Francisco, Madeline, what do you need, guys? My family. Your family. I, I need tacos and beer. Tacos and beer. <laughs> okay, Sylvia, Isaac. Yeah, what my lady. <laughs> Harrison, what do you need? My body. To relax your body. Yes. Okay, to relax your body. All right, Doris, what do you need to be happy? Mm, the beach. Beach, <laughs> yeah. Ava, what do you need? And dish and sleep. Dish and sleep. Okay, okay. <laughs> nice. 
and I hope everybody gets it. Very nice. I, I really like this part. You got it, guys. Now, um, well, this is pretty much what you were doing, like the activities that you have to do and you and your classmate. But I'm going to jump to one more thing because this is our core. Let's take a look. It says here, make a conversation using me to, to ask for. Vamos a crear una conversación, all right, donde vamos a agregar ambientes diferentes. We are talking about need to, lo que necesitamos, have to, lo que es obligatorio. But imagine, guys, that you have to ask for permission. And in El Salvador, no sé si a ustedes les pasa, but normally nuestros jefes nos dicen, ¿para qué quiere permiso? What do you need to do? Yeah? When do you need your permission? Okay? So, usted tiene que explicarle. ¿Qué es lo que va a hacer? What is the necessity you have to, all right? Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm, boss, I need permission for a day because I need to go to the hospital and I need to get some x-rays, et cetera, et cetera. So, they will explicarle. This is situation number one. Then we have another situation that is a need to extra time, yeah? So, extra time se refiere como necesita tiempo adicional. You need like some extra time for one report. So you can be like, hey boss, I didn't have enough time to complete the activity. I need to, to have more days eh, to complete one report. I need to have more help, okay? I need to have another computer because I am doing a lot of things. So you need to ask for extra time. The other possibility is overtime. ¿Alguien se recuerda que es overtime? OT? Más tiempo. Horas extra. Horas extra, exactly. En El Salvador le llamamos horas extra. So you need overtime. O, o necesita que le pague el overtime. That's another possibility. So we got to ask for overtime o que les paguen el overtime. Or you need assistance. Like, cuando les llenan de mucho trabajo, when you are, have a lot of things to do, y necesita como alguien que le ayude, right? So you can tell, hey boss, look, I have a lot of responsibilities, I have a lot of things to do, I need some help. I need, I don't know, a, in the case of accountants, for example, I need this person to help me because I have a lot of balance to complete, and you know? So, eso es como una negociación, right? No vamos a complicarle tan much. Vamos a usar lo mismo que acabamos de hacer con need to and have to. Pero pueden escoger una. Choose only one situation. Ya sea pedir permiso. You can ask for permission. Pedir tiempo adicional. Extra time. Pedir horas extras. O que les paguen horas extras. O pedir asistencia o ayuda extra. Right? So, uh, uh, because we are going to be working as a group. So you can decide to be like boss employees or que es lo más fácil, right? Cuando vamos con recursos humanos, when we go with human resources, it solicitamos algo. So one person can be the representative of human resources y los demás vamos a solicitar uh, alguna de estas situaciones utilizando need to and have to, all right? Um, is it clear? ¿Está claro lo que vamos a hacer? The, the activity, yes? Yes, yes. Yes. Francisco? Sí. Vamos a hacer una conversación. Make a conversation using need to. Vamos a utilizar lo mismo que acabamos de ver. Need to and have to. Pero como explica. Exacto. Son demasiadas situaciones en tu match. All right. Como grupo, escojamos una situación. Ya sea pedir permiso, pedir tiempo adicional, pedir horas extras o el pago de horas extras o solicitar ayuda o asistencia extra. Uh -huh. So, pónganse de acuerdo como grupo, vamos a escoger esta situación and creamos una conversación de esa situación específica. Uh -huh. Usando need to and have to. So, uh, I'm going to create the groups one more time so you can practice with more people. Give me one second. And... Uh, and there we go okay everybody so join the groups please you have 10 minutes y luego regresamos then we come no you have less you have like nine minutes so go to the groups go to the groups practice let's work on it y luego regresamos then we come back
eh, podría ser la situación de uh, uh, employee with the boss. César, casi no se le escucha. ¿Ahora? Se me escucha más hoy. No sé si será yes. el micrófono. Sí, sí. Okay. La voz es in the voice, in the voice. <laughs> Okay, the situation uh, can see uh, the boss with a uh, employee. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And the person is the chief. Okay. Yes. <laughs> okay. Nosotros al employee. Employee. Podría ser que el empleado llegue a donde el jefe a decirle, eh, hello boss, can you, can you attend us? Voy a atenderme, creo es, sí. Uh -huh. Hello boss. Do you help me? Good morning. Can you... Good morning. <laughs> Can you attend me? Así, así sería, ¿verdad? Can you attend Can you attend me? Y yeah, el jefe dice... Eh, yes. Good morning. Yes. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Yes. yes. Eh, ¿Cómo se dice? Can you, ¿Puedes pasar? Juan. ¿Puedes pasar? ¿Puedes entrar a la oficina? ¿Ah? Ajá. Sí, algo así. You can uh, come in. I'm coming in. You can, you can come in. You can come in. Okay. Come in. You can come in. Come in. Eh, ok, el empleado que le diga eh, No, ahí tendría, que, ahí, ahí tendría que hacer la, pre, la pregunta What, uh, what uh, do you need? What do you need? Ok, ajá uh -huh. uh, You can ¿Cómo era lo, lo de Entra a la oficina? Uh, you can, you can, can come in ¿Cómo? You, you can, can come in. Y ahí, what do you need? What, what do you need? Uh -huh. Y el empleo necesita teach, uh, uh, I need I need to uh, permission. For why need Permission. Ajá. Ajá. Y ahí el jefe pregunta, why do you need eh, to permission? Uh -huh. Ok. ¿Y por qué después de va? Porque Cristian nos saludó, ¿verdad? Eh, primero, uh -huh. y luego poner este el nombre de don Guillermo en vez de poner Guillermo ponemos este empleado y luego empieza a salir uno por uno a, a mencionarse porque ahí le vamos a saludar todo verdad después de que él nos saluda de que queremos hablar con él y sí, pero la petición es sindical acuérdese Ajá, la, petición, la petición es como que todo va y el vocero Ajá. puede ser y en Ajá. algunos momentos pueden. Sí, puede que usted nos saludó, contestarlo en, en todos nosotros que no. queremos hablar con usted. Ahorita Guillermo es el vocero. Ajá, Guillermo es el vocero ahí. Ay, sí. Entonces. Sí. Bueno, entonces, diría, Cristian, uh, we, we need to talk with you Ajá. about paying Ajá. overtime. Ajá, pero como ahí yo les pongo, yo, ok, yo. how can I help Ajá. them? Ok, uh -huh. how can Ajá, I help them? Y Guillermo contesta. Y Guillermo contesta. O yo puedo decirle. Ajá. We can. You tell you. You talk. We. Ajá. 
We need about. We, we need. Ajá. Pero ahí, ajá. Otra vez lo vuelven a decir. Uh, 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 finish to the report. Primero que le diga si ya termina el reporte para darle el reporte. Ajá, ajá. <laughs> no. Name, mm, no, what no, is the my, name? Your, your, the name? Uh, no, no, it's a lie. <laughs> uh, you, you can go with your husband, I don't know where. <laughs> <laughs> so, no, te quiero decir el nombre del, del doctor es... Ay, ya me, ya me trabé toda, hombre. Where? Why? Why do you want the permission? Or what do you need? Why do you need the permission? With, with, with him, to with live him early. Of doctor. He's, um, <laughs> se me olvidó. <laughs> Ah, pues no hay permiso. No, uh, de de doctor, de doctor, doctor. No, no, no. no, no. With him name of Dr. Garcia. Dr. Garcia. Yes. Y when do you need the permission? No, no. What time do you need the permission? What time y when? If Pero it's si... today, no permission because... It's very short the time for the, tell me. Long time. Ah. Uh, Herson is a difficult boss. It's <laughs> very <laughs> complicated boss. No, no. Herson is a difficult boss. But, but I like it, very nice. So can I explain it? <laughs> Voy a ir al sindicato. Oh. Aquí You are fired. <laughs> so, uh, 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 oh, so this is at Seguro Social, Ada. It, um, many hours, much hour in the de, para pasar consulta es medio día mínimo. Ah, yes, it is yeah. true. You need a lot of time. A lot, you need of, a lot time. of time. Yes. And, and so, the difficult bus. Milagros say. Uh, <laughs> yeah, what a difficult bus. <laughs> permission today? No. I have a he, appointment he, at four in the afternoon with the dentist. Oh, she has an appointment. I have an appointment at four in the afternoon uh -huh. with the dentist, boss. Please. With the dentist. With Dr. Garcia, she says. <laughs> Dr. Garcia. I don't, I... But, but tomorrow is, is Saturday. Go to the salary. <laughs> it's Dr. Privati. It's Monday. 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 ¿Y qué necesito? Mm, eh, extra tiempo. No, un asistente necesito. I don't, I don't. ¿Cómo puedo decirlo? I need. I, ajá. I need uh -huh. an assistance an assistance because I have a lot of work. Uh -huh. But because because I have to para poner I have to I have to finish, finish the report, algo así. Me quedé, eh, dijiste, I need an assistant. Ah, no, I need, uh, I need an assistant. Uh -huh. Because, uh -huh. 
Ahí tú, ahí me he quedado. Because I have to finish the report. Finish the report. The report. Can you help me? Hey everyone, thank you so much for coming back. I believe I got everybody. So I listened to your dialogues guys and I'm very happy because I think you got it. So I don't know if I have any volunteer, someone would, would like to start. So veo el grupo, uh, yeah. Que me activo el micrófono guys. I, I, I was like, oh, Caesar, thank you. Oh, super good. So, Caesar group, let's start. <laughs> okay, teacher. Andrew. Sorry. And, oh, ah, okay. Andrew, Fatima, Andrew. and Sandra, ¿verdad? Okay, and okay, Sandra. guys. Vamos, Andres. Okay. Let's go. <laughs> Sandra the boss. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hello, boss. Hello, boss. Good morning. Can Hello, Cesar. Good morning. Can you attend on me? Yeah. Can you, you can come in. You can come in the office. What do you need? Uh, boss, I need to have uh, permission. What? <laughs> what do you need to permission? Ya desperté. Beautiful boss. I have to go to the doctor oh. because I'm sick. I'm stomach cake. Mm, okay. I have how much? Idea. How much? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Too many. You people. much eat. Too much eat. <laughs> the proposal. How much? How much time do you need to the hospital? Uh, I need to four hours in the afternoon, please. Okay, nice. Take a uh, medicine. In no alerts in the office. Go back to the hospital. Yes. Thanks. Thanks, boss. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, it's not, that was okay. That was okay. <laughs> Many details, but that was okay. <laughs> Okay, uh, guys, one more. Who wants to be the last one of the day? Alguien que no tenga lo de doctor, like something different? Like, I don't know, asking for OT, asking for a pay raise, asking for something different? Nobody. Teacher, ya son los 10. 
Yes, yes, that's why, that's why, miss. So, that's why. Uh, Andrés, escoja el último y así terminamos. So, solo les robo two more minutes. Eh, madre. Madeline, all right. Uh, no, okay. don't, don't worry, uh, Milagro, that would not be you. <laughs> Madeline, who was okay. your group? My group is Doris and Veronica. Is a que tiene problemas de audio, pero lo incluimos en... Ah, ok, ok. <laughs> ok, start. Comienza, Vero. Hello. Uh, good morning, Doris. Hi, Vero. Good morning. What do you need? I need permission to go to my medical appointment. Mm, Veronica? But first, you have to finish the report. Sure. I will send you the report in IR. Excellent. You can go to your medical appointment. Thank you very much. Buena gente. Hi, boss. Yes. Nice boss. Hi. Madeline? Hi, boss. I need to ask you a favor. Hey, Madeline, tell me. Yes. Can I help you? I need an assistant because I have I have to finish the report. Can you help me? Yes, of course. Isa will help you. Thank you, boss. Nice, <laughs> nice, very good. And claps for the boss as well. She is a very nice boss, you know. And can you be my boss as well? <laughs> I need permission as well. That was super good. Thank you, everybody, for your uh, participation. That was very nice. Thank you for your attendance. Espero que tengan un excelente fin de semana. Enjoy it. Enjoy your Saturday, your Sunday. And please, Peter. no se les olvide ayudarme con el midterm con la evaluación de este fin de semana. Debemos de completar no solo las tareas hasta la número eh, 10, right? sino también la parte del midterm de la evaluación media o examen medio que les aparece, porfa. Eh, no está difícil, no les toma más de, you know, 15 minutos en total, I believe, está bastante simple. Eh, y no se les olvide, por favor, darle clic en Submit para que el sistema se los capture. Eh, Sandra, cualquier cosa, eh, estábamos teniendo dificultades, pero yo le, le aviso, oiga, yo le escribo si tengo algún problema con, con sus notas, pero creería que no. Oiga, thank you very much. Eh, Gerson, no sé si tenía una duda, anything. Gracias, teacher. You're welcome. Thank you. Gracias. Bye bye. Gracias. Thank you, teacher. Good night. Bye bye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. See you. Bye.